In this video, I'll show you how to use the web browser that is coming with your LG Smart TV. You need to take your remote control and press the home button that is looking like this one. This small menu should appear on the bottom of your TV and you should go to, to web browser. The icon should look like this one, but if you have a different LG Smart TV than me, the icon may look different. You should press OK. This screen will pop out as the home screen and you'll have a few favorites already chosen by LG. To control the cursor, this little thing, you need to use the arrows or if you have a magic remote, it's much, much easier since you can point at stuff. But I'll use the arrows for this example. If you want to go on a specific website that you already know, you need to go in the search bar over here and click the OK button once you're on it. Here you'll be able to type whatever website you want to go. So let's say I want to go on the Apple website. Well, I just need to type Apple. Once you're done, select the enter option and press OK on your remote control and you'll be directed to the website. Now, if you want to make this page your favorites so you can see it on the home screen, so it's much, much easier to access the next time, all you have to do is go with your cursor on the star located right over here. Go on it and press OK once you're on it. All you have to do is select the Yes option here. And you'll have the confirmation appearing right over here. If you want to watch TV at the same time as you're browsing the web, you have to select this option right over here, the first one. Go on it and press OK. A small screen will appear over here with whatever you're watching previously. Here I was on HDMI 1, which has no signal, but if you're watching live TV, it will appear here or whatever else uh, you are using. To close it, you just need to press again on this option and it will remove it. If you want to zoom on the page, since you may not see particularly well some details, press on this magnifying glass and select a number higher than a hundred percent. You can press more and the more you press, the more you're gonna have this website zoomed in. To go back, it's easy. You just need to press on the minus sign till it's at a hundred percent. Now we have more options over here. By pressing this little icon with three lines, you have access to the history, so you can see all the previous website you browsed, to your bookmarks, to settings, and to encoding. If you select this fourth option right over here, it will put this website in full screen mode, so it will remove this part of the screen. Click on it, and as you can see, the website will take all your TV screen, so it will be much, much bigger. To go back, just press the back button on your remote control. If you press the X, if you press the X button, it will close your web browser, so only do it when you're done using it. Now, you can also open multiple tabs on this browser. All you have to do is go on the plus button right over here. And once it's selected, it will go pink and press the OK on your remote control. And this will open another tab and you'll be able to choose between your favorites or type a new website. As you can see, the favorite we just added a few seconds ago is right over here. And you can add many tabs, as you can see. It will keep going. You can add another one. 
So this is the basic of using the web browser inside of your LG Smart TV. Please leave a comment or subscribe or even give a like if this video was helpful.